study here in Waslico. As part of the Chamber of Commerce, we're so proud to continue to be out here celebrating businesses here in this community. And we want to thank Benjamin Moore for becoming members of the Chamber and, uh, and their commitment to this community and being a part of Waslico. Uh, we're so excited when we got the call and, and they were so interested in having their ribbon cutting in. Is it has to happen in March? We want to get this going. We want to get this done. And so we're just so grateful to you all for, again, becoming members of the Chamber and being a part of this organization, but most importantly, being a part of Waslico. At this time, I would like to uh, invite our Mayor of Wasico, Mayor Adrian Gonzalez, to share a few words on the behalf of the city of Wasico. Uh, what is it? Well, we can say still, good morning. Good morning, everybody, in this gorgeous day. Uh, again, it's always exciting. It, it, it's, it's exciting to have these ribbon cuttings because they just show uh, that Wesico continues to grow. And a lot of these faces here, it's like they're family to me because I see you guys probably at least once a week, which is a good thing because again, it shows that Wesico is growing and we're continuing to having these ribbon cuttings. So again, sir, Mr. Joe and, and David Vogel, we thank you guys for cho choosing Wesico. Wesico will continue to grow. And with businesses like yourself that are here in Wesico, it just makes everything so much better. And not only do you service Westico, but you'll be servicing all the Mid Valley. Um, you know, so that is great for our community and our surrounding communities. We welcome you to Westico. We thank you for choosing Westico. And what a great, just a, a gorgeous area here. I see Mr. Craig back here that, that it was his vision a while back, you know, to put this together. And I was just talking to him right now and he was telling me that he had all this design and he passed by here several times and he made it he made it happen and i'm glad that he convinced you guys to come over here to westico but like i said you made a great choice choosing westico thank you guys i wish you nothing but the best and success and whatever you need from from us we will always be here thank you <laughs> commissioner you want to say something Good morning, everybody, and a happy Baby Friday, as I usually say. But uh, David, Joe, thank you again. Like Mayor said, thank you for choosing Wasco, and most importantly, for, for investing in Wasco. I know you mentioned Craig coming by here, and he said a few times, but I think it was probably about a thousand times when Craig was saying that. I was a little nervous coming today because uh, I moved into my house about five years ago, and the wife started talking about painting. And I don't know if this is a sign. I'm going to have to go back in there and buy some stuff. but. I'm excited, we're here for you guys. We're, as you can see, we have a lot of business owners, the Red Coats are here to support you. Your success is our success. And at the end of the day, we're here to help. We're just a phone call away. And like Mayor said, thank you again, and thank you for choosing Wealthy Coast. Thank you, Commissioner Farias. Uh, and again, here in Wasico, and, and as the Benjamin Moore team, you'll see that we are definitely a close-knit community. We believe in supporting local business, and uh, so that's why you see a lot of these great people here today who I'd like to recognize. Our Red Coat ambassadors, our business leaders within the community who come out to support local businesses. They work for organizations in this community or also represent independent businesses in Wasico. So we thank our Red Coats. Let's give them a round of applause. I'd also like to recognize our Wesleyco Royal Court. These students are ambassadors for Wesleyco and they represent our community in different events across uh, Wesleyco and across the Rio Grande Valley. So I would love to recognize our Mr. Wesleyco, Miss Wesleyco, Junior Miss Texas Onion Fest and Miss Texas Onion Fest for being here with us today. I would also like to take this time to thank any of our board members who are here as well from the Wesleyco Chamber of Commerce and of course, our executive director for the Wesleyco EDC and his team who are here as well. Let's give them a round of applause. As we continue uh, with this presentation, I would love to invite Ms. Sandra Charlton to say a few words on behalf of the Wesleyco EDC. Thank you, Barbara. Uh, we're just so excited to be here today to have another celebration of business, and we're so glad to that you're here and, and that you've chosen Wesleyco to continue your very successful business. Um, I was talking to David and he was just telling me about the process of choosing Westlaco and anyone who wants to know, please talk to him because he's a great ambassador for Westlaco, even though he's from San Antonio, but we'll maybe get him down here a little bit more. Uh, anyway, just such a beautiful space here and we're just so excited to celebrate with you and just say congratulations. So, yeah, 
Yes, I mean, you'll see here in Wasico, we truly believe in coming together and supporting local business. And so what's really important to us is to hear from you and hear about your story, why Waslico, and of course, this a beautiful area. So I'd like to start by inviting you, Joe, to come up here and share a few words on behalf of your team and of course, this organization. I'm Joe Sierra, I'm the owner of Sierra Propane and even more. Well, my voice is gone, I've talked to too many people this week. Um, <laughs> We opened our first store in 2019 in McAllen. We've done really well, and I knew we wanted to come to West Africa. Um, I worked for the competition many, many years, and I know how they do things, and what they do well, and what they don't. So this, uh, I know the Benjamin Moore part, no, Benjamin Moore is gonna work out for us. It's, it's a great product. Uh, we're always trying to get the best service uh, that we can. Uh, but coming to West Africa, I knew it was gonna be a, I can see. I, we had an ambition. We knew that we wanted to come here. Talking to the Benjamin Moore team, David, uh, Chavini, our sales rep, I told them that we need to be in the West for our second location. We have to be we need to catch some of the business on this other end instead of going to the North McAllen area. I knew the growth in West Mexico, so we're happy to be here. Uh, I know we're going to be a great success. I know that the patient's awesome. Thank you, friends, for visiting me in numerous amounts of times in McAllen. The building's beautiful. Perfect. Um, thank you, everybody, Chamber of Commerce, for being here. Uh, uh, I mean, I'm just happy. My wife, uh, my staff, uh, growing with me, and uh, of course the Benjamin Moore team, Diane, David, David, uh, all of the Davids and Benjamin Moore. Thank you all so much, and that's pretty much it. And uh, thank you all for being here. Thank you, Joe, and thank you once again for having us today. I'd also like to invite David Vogel with Benjamin Moore to come up and share a few words. Hi guys, how are you? So um, Joe came to us a while ago and he opened this uh, store over in McAllen. Had great growth, great success, strong, strong community base, everything was going fantastic. And he came over to my court and said, hey look, there's an area in, uh, just to the east. It's fantastic, it's growing like a weed and you know, there's potential there. So I, what I do for a living is I essentially assess what's going on in an area, and this place was a diamond in the rough. It was absolutely fantastic for the community, for the families, for the for everything that's going on, everything that you have going on here as far as commerce. Because you can see around you, all of the businesses that are surrounding this particular area are strong, stable, fantastic businesses that, that provide a huge service to the community. And so I thought this is going to be a, a great fit. Know what he brings to the table with uh, with Joe and Iris, as, as far as their their uh, professionalism and business acumen. I was like, this is going to be a perfect fit. So I wanted to say thank you to the the area, uh, Westco, for providing just a, a huge background for a company like ours to come in and be able to support what's going on in the network. So with that, Joe and uh, Iris, thank you very much for being here. Congratulations to you. I'm excited for you. I'm excited for what the opportunity brings, and I'm really excited for. Future holds. So, thank you very much. Thank you, David. And I can't let Craig get away without sh uh, sharing a few words. So, Craig, I'd love to invite you up to come and share a few words uh, about this beautiful space, about your vision. I know that you've uh, been a part of several of these ribbon cuttings, and I think that's so special uh, as part of you being a developer and being out here supporting these businesses and you know seeing this vision come to fruition. So. You know, congrats to you on making this happen for us here in Wasico, and we'd love to hear from you on, you know, where we are at this point. Good morning. Thank you so much for having me. It's a, it's a pleasure to be here, and congratulations, Joe. What what an amazing event, and uh, this has just been a, a great project to work on from the beginning. Um, Joe wasn't lying about the number of times I went over to try to convince him to move over here. Um, but you know, from the very beginning, the community of Westlaco has really been uh, welcomed us with open arms and been great to work with. From the economic development uh, program to the permitting, um, the, the void of the tenants and the depth of the categories in Westlaco, it had all of the components that um, retail needs to thrive. And so this was um, an incredible testament to the, the depth of Westlaco itself. 
And so, you know, not only is he covering all of my buildings, but hopefully he's going to be covering the rest of the, uh, the city and the Rio Grande Metroplex with some of this paint. So we're excited. Congratulations on today and welcome. Thank you guys. Thank you so much, Craig. Appreciate it. And yes, absolutely. One of the things we love about Westico is that we're right, right in the center. So you're in the center of the valley and we, we really, uh, you know, we love to see when businesses come out here because you're gonna see people from all over the place coming from across the valley right here to Westico. We like to call ourselves the heart of the Mid Valley. So you're in the perfect spot. And uh, I do wanna reach out to those who are online and joining us through social media and welcome you to this great facility. I'm sure that you have seen the spaces that are coming up here off the express where we invite you to come out and check out all of the local businesses here, uh, right here in Westico. So once again, thank you uh, to Benjamin Moore, Sarah Pro Paint, for having us here and uh, being a part of our Chamber of Commerce. Uh, I do wanna recognize, of course, the city of Wasico for all the work they do in helping our businesses open and be ready to go. I do wanna to, want, to, want to recognize our city manager, Mr. Martin Garza, for all he does for our community. So thank you, Mr. Garza and, and the city of Wasico team who's here as well. As we continue with the uh, ceremony, I would like to invite one of our Red Coat ambassadors, Ms. Alex Montenegro, to share a few words on behalf of our ambassador team and the Chamber of Commerce. Well, good, what is it, good morning? Good morning still. <laughs> um, good morning everyone, and thank you for joining us here on this beautiful day in Westlaco. For those of you joining us on Facebook, uh, thank you so much for joining us for this amazing event. Um, well, again, you can't, you're not gonna get that many thank yous, right? Like today, like thank you, thank you, right? But we're so happy and so honored that you all chose Westlaco. It's definitely an area a city that's just booming and we couldn't be happier that you chose to be here to be part of this amazing milestone that this city is going through you know in the past few years everybody's witnessed it people i know that don't live here tell me all the time man what's up what are y'all doing out there i'm like it's us it's the people we're happy we love it we we welcome everybody that comes into our community so thank you for that we wish you much success and thank you for becoming a member of the westaco area chamber of commerce so I want to present with you a plaque to commemorate um, not only becoming a member, but your grand opening today. We welcome you, we congratulate you on behalf of the board of the chamber and our red coats, our community. Welcome and we wish you the best. And with that, I think we're ready for a ribbon cutting, yes? I think so, okay, so we can have all the team join us right here in the center, and then we'll have our red coats join us as well. So Joe, I'll have you here in the center with the team around you. So I think we're ready to cut the ribbon, Joe. So we'll have you prepare there with the giant scissors. And if y'all wanna join me and count to three, we will get ready to cut the ribbon. All right, so one, two, and three. Congratulations to Benjamin Moore, Sierra Pro Paint, and welcome to Westlaco.
I'm blinded by light. <laughs> Like, uh, I don't know what it was, but it's, 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 it's But it's wrong. Yeah. So, like right now, they just figured that out. And I got a notification that I've never seen before. But it's wrong. So. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna end this already. Okay. Yeah. <laughs>